Hi, this is Rockin' Robin, and today I'm in Dania Beach, Florida. I am at Mad Art. It's an immersive arts and lights exhibit. Check it out. So this is the entrance. It's at 41 South Federal Highway in Dania Beach. And when you first go in, this is what you will see. This is the front office and you will pay the girls it's about 20 21 dollars each something like that and then they will bring you to the elevator because you want to start on the second floor the elevator is all lit up and you can see lights right from there so you know this is going to be a very interesting experience we have exited the elevator and we are looking for where we need to go. And we are going to go to that, which is the first exhibit. This one is called The Empty Mirror of the Sky. The second exhibit is called Existence. This one is the verse verse. We choose a character and they will recreate what it may look like. And then we will print it out. And we print it out, there will be two copies. And one copy we will put on their wall and one copy we will keep. We chose the Your Walkie. And it shows you a little bit about it there. And now we will print it out and show you what it looks like. there it is and once we get the printed copies I put one on the wall and we kept one to take home very cool and here are some others that other people chose In the next exhibit, we are going to see a poem as a work of art. Check it out. This one was not in English, and I don't know exactly what it was called, but I thought it was quite interesting. And I want to show you a little bit of all the exhibits, you know, so when you go, you understand a little bit more. I hope it helps. This one is called The Curious Two. And it's a dance of light. And it goes down kind of and up a staircase. It was very beautiful. 
So this one is called Forest Perception. And it was quite interesting. On one side, you see from below the trees and you can see the roots, you're underground. And on the other side over here, you see above the trees and you're looking down. So you can look either way or you can look both to see what one side's looking at and the other side would see. Oh, very, very interesting. You saw animals sitting, uh, different things that you wouldn't realize, the roots. Take a look. Now I am going to enter laser-like water, and you're told not to look directly at the laser. Quite interesting, very dark. I think it can make you dizzy if you look too much at the laser. Don't stay in there too long, but it was quite interesting to take a look. This one is Sirens. It's holographic images of sea creatures and mermaids. So this one was quite creepy. This is Ophelia. Uh, a Shakespeare character, and this is supposed to be her last moments in a basin, and it very much looked like a casket, and it was very, very creepy. Now, this one is not in English. I think it's in German, so I'm not exactly sure what it is, but take a look. Now this one is luminescent and it's an interactive screen. So it's actually the one that's the most fun if you're looking to do some interactions. You're in kind of a forest scape and if you go around with your hands, you can make things happen. And it's a lot of fun to check out. I'm gonna make some fire. This one is called the fourth dimension. The colors and the lights are absolutely beautiful. This exhibit is called The Hunter. And you will see the hunter in the house and you will hear him. He will come out, he will talk to a bird, and then he will go and he will sit in a tree and he will wait to shoot a deer. 
and he actually will shoot the deer. There's a place for you to sit so you can watch the whole scene happen right in front of you. So now we're waiting for the elevator to arrive. And once we get on the elevator, we're going to go back to the first floor to see the exhibits over there. This exhibit is called Resonance, and you get a blurred perception. You walk through that triangle, and on the screen will show like a blurred perception of what you look like. You can walk fast or slow, whatever way you want through that arch. The next one is called Core, and it was kind of like a video and a music, and the lights were dancing kind of to the music. It was interesting. Uh, the room was very dark, and you had to kind of walk around because it was on all four walls, but the uh, lights really moved around, and uh, it was a lot of fun to watch. The last one that we saw is called the graffiti wall. And you got to put your own graffiti onto the wall and write whatever it is you want to do. And can you tell what it is that I am going to say? Yep, I am writing Rockin' Robin. Well, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to subscribe, hit the bell, give us a big thumbs up, and watch all our videos around Florida.